Okay, uh, here we're going to uh, show you a project that uh, we're about uh, working on. This is for physical access control. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, and uh, so what we have here is uh, this is a, a telephone, uh, a, a, an keyboard. outside, uh, yeah. two types of keyboards. One is uh, uh, like heavy duty. heavy duty for outside grade, and, cheap, and this is cheaper for indoor grade. And so what they've got is basically uh, one of our micro clients. This could be done on a uh, micro client SX, which is being done on a DX because this will integrate uh, a biometric finger uh, printing control for uh, workers, right? Right. And then uh, basically what we've got here is also we can use uh, facial recognition and uh, uh, this is a, a box that's being custom made uh, with the um, control panel. Yeah. And uh, also uh, this uh, will be used for access control either for a smart card or magnetic magnetic card. So. Um, Anyway, uh, you can speak uh, could put Thai Dai. Put Thai Dai. Hello, could put the application Thai Dai. I will translate. Ah, uh, application, right? Application of mine will be like an access control. This is an access control application. But it will be access control that has function. But it will be the access control has lots of functions. It means that if we if we press finger button one, it will be finger button two. For example, let's say you want to use a fingerprint to enter one point. Uh, and then you need to, you're waiting for the finger same fingerprint to go yeah, to another yeah. point. Yeah. Uh, and we can also uh, photograph the picture to match it with the fingerprint. Uh, and uh, so we don't need to use a very large screen. We just use this small screen right here. Yeah. And the most important thing is the finger printer. If we use this, if we use a one to n, I mean the identification is a is a maybe a error. Okay, so you're going to could you try one to one? So using one to one fingerprint identification. This one, you you have to enter the code first. Okay, you have to key in your code first. And then uh, key in your uh, user finger. This is better. Uh, it'll search the database. ดังที่สองก็คือว่าความคือความความแม่นของเขาเนี่ยไม่ไม่แม่นหมายความว่าเรามันก็จะช้าเพราะมันต้องกินซีพียูใหญ่นะโอเคโอเคไม่รู้จ
กะเข้าอะชิปอะชิปเข้ากับชิปออกอะชิปอะ And so uh, we, if we want to change shifts, uh, one this one, yeah, chip, and then one means that star one, 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 one would mean it would be the uh, uh, first shift coming in. And that would be the first shift coming out. This will will make the programming much uh, simpler. Yes, easy, 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 much simpler. And one more thing. This one is for food court. This is for a food court. Yes. This is module. The module. Yes. At about nine can connect for one PC. So we have nine of these readers for one PC. One PC module, which is a microserver, micro client. Yeah, yeah, yeah. DX. Yes. Yeah. One. Yes. You can this many. Yes, and this one connect with the the PC. And and this will connect to the PC. By use the IP IP connection. It'll it'll use TCP IP. Ah, TCP IP. Yeah. So I mean, then Wi-Fi die. Yes, then Wi-Fi die. It can it can be Wi-Fi or wired TCP IP connection. Yes, it will make it easier for us to run Wi-Fi. Yes, it will make it easier for us to run Wi-Fi. Yes, it will make it easier for us to run Wi-Fi. Yes, it will make it easier for us to run Wi-Fi. Yes, it will make it easier for us to run Wi-Fi. Yes, it will make it easier for us to run Wi-Fi. Yes, it will make it easier for us to run Wi-Fi. Yes, it will make it easier for us to run Wi-Fi. Yes, it will make it easier for us to run Wi-Fi. Yes, it will make it easier for us to run Wi-Fi. Yes, it will make it easier for us to run Wi-Fi. Yes, it will make it easier for us to run Wi-Fi. Yes